I'm Ashen Wings, Lord of the Horde, and you are all my faithful treasures. Or at least you would be if you're subscribed to the channel. So please do so and enjoy today's episode. Transition. Welcome back, dragon folk, to another episode of Tales of Arise. So we are still on our way back to Mosgul to help our friends because uh, they're in trouble. Oh, I found another alcohol. So more wolves to kill. I won't forgive you. Oh, did my mirage not go off? That's awful. Here I come. It's over. It's on. I'm not done. Eat dirt. We did it. By the power of water. Oh, that's a lot of damage. See it? You got absolutely wrecked. I might want to just play a she on Looks if I like can we do that. Won. Lots of uh, lots of like herbs and spices and stuff coming around. What was that? Oh. Oh, I see. They're literally like wearing the thing. I'm surprised there are owls here too. Yeah, there are more of them around than I thought. Huh. Well, you know where that cat one's going to, right? Can't have cat ears without a cat tail, am I right? Can't even see it without one ponytail. Shion's got long hair, really long hair. All right, fast travel point added. Well, the fast travel point's added. We can go to Mazgul. What's our we got 106? Reco I think we'll be fine. I don't. I don't have an issue with that. I think we'll be okay. Now you'll learn. <laughs> Mess with uh -oh. my friends, will you? You just crossed the wrong line. Ooh, you don't get it. Oh. Oh. Something's gonna happen here. I'm gonna like awake the rage within me or something. Dang. That was uh pretty crazy. Hey, hang in there. Hey, damn it. Oh no, save the residents of Mosgul. I don't know anything really. Please don't kill me, I beg you. Oh no. Not too late. Stop. Please don't hurt the children. What's that? Damn it, I can't reach them in time. Get back, Cole. Duck. Cole, stop! We are whooping this guy's ass. Here I go. It's over. You're off. By the power of God. Here I come. It's Take over. This. Take this. It's over. Here I go. You're off. You're mine. You're mine. Gemini. It's over. Easy mode. Here I go. You're mine. Easy mode. Get out of here. Don't you touch my friends. Are you all right? What about the others? Are those bastards still here? Iron Mask, take it easy. It's all right now. <laughs> Most were able to escape, and we've survived. Honestly, we got off lucky. It's often worse when a resistance group pops up. Lucky? You call people getting slaughtered like this lucky? This is how things go when you're a Danon slave. You're dead if you stand up to them. Keep your head down and do as you're told. At least then you have a chance to survive. You only have one life. That's why... I should wait for the right moment? Yes. So someone else dies instead while we live another day. Is that what you're saying, Doc? You're willing to risk everything on the chance that things will get better if we wait long enough. But what's the point of waiting if others have to die so that we can live? What do you think happens when someone tries to resist? It'd be one thing if the rebel died and that was that. But it never ends with only one death. You've seen it for yourself. Everyone suffers for it. Knowing that, 
Are you really going to tell me our waiting has no meaning? But that's... I understand not wanting to throw away the same lives we're trying to protect. That would be senseless. But if you wait too long, if you get too used to waiting, then eventually you lose the will to fight. I don't want that to happen to me. I've already met the Crimson Crows. People who risk their lives to fight the Renan's rule. People who know they might not live to see us win, but fight anyway to give those who come after a better chance. If my life is at risk either way, then I'd rather spend it fighting. So you've decided to take up the sword? Yes, but not just any sword. It's a sword that only I can wield, but one that's also too powerful to use on my own. I doubt those who fought the Renans in the past ever had something like this on their side. That's why I'm willing to bet everything I have on this sword. I know it might mean more people end up in danger, but... Okay. If that's how you feel, then forget what I said. It's clear your time has come, Iron Mask. Currently, you and that sword are the only things capable of driving the Renans back. It's because of you that we're still alive right now. If there's a way through this for all of us, then I'll put my trust in you to find it. Doc... Thank you. Now, remember what you said. And don't ever abandon that conviction of yours, all right? Right. I won't. You've grown so much since we first met. And you've met some good people, too. Maybe you have a chance after all. Oh, Doc. No, man. Turn to Wolves back. So we did it, okay. Why? Why do the Renans have to be so cruel to us? Is it something we did? Did we do something wrong? Do you know why, Iron Mask? I just don't get it. Wow. Yeah, this guy's got messed up. But look at that. We're back where we were. Damn it. We keep, we keep our heads down to do this. We're told and this is the things we get. They didn't even listen to what we had to say. They just killed them without a second thought. Yep. This is the... This is really the... The double-edged sword of fighting against tyranny. Is the more you fight, the more the lesser... Suffer. And... It is unfortunate. It is unfortunate. Now, I'm sure he's gonna be haunted by that thought. I guess we could always just... Go back to the wolf's back. Travel along this place. The Renans. You're back. Hurry on in. We've been waiting for you. You're not gonna ask what happened? I can tell enough by the way you look right now. I see. Zephyr, I need to ask you something. Would you have invited me to join you, even if I didn't have the Blazing Sword? Of course. Why, though? There are many folks out there who are crazy enough to resist the Renans like we do. So when I find someone with the knack for it, I make sure to keep them close. Plus, you remind me of another guy we lost. Maybe deep down, I'm trying to help you as a way of making amends for what I couldn't do for him. But if you don't want this, just say the word. I'm not going anywhere. If it weren't for you, I wouldn't even be here. If you say so. All right, come on in. Thanks. All right. Yes.
Iron Mask, can I have a minute of your time? What's wrong? Hey, Diron, what do you need? Well, all you've been doing since you got here is fight, right? I'm starting to get worried about how your weapon's hold. After all, you're about to fight Balsif. You'll need to be prepared for whatever he might throw at you. Luckily, we happen to have a blacksmith here on site. You should see got what he's it. got tempered. Alright, I'll make sure to remember that. Forging from scratch. Forging from scratch. Give display priority to the quest you just accepted. Yes, absolutely. All right. Consult with the blacksmith at the inn. Absolutely want a new weapon. We'll gladly take a new weapon. Hello. Hey. You the blacksmith? Yeah. Here? Yep. Diron filled me in. In addition to farm tools, I also make weapons for the Crimson Crows. Knowing it's for you, I just have to help. I'll forge you the best weapon I can manage with the materials I've got. Craft a weapon. This one's good. I need an astral crystal grain. But I can make this a start. This one, I just need an astral crystal grain and I can upgrade that. You don't need it. Wait. Basic rifle. I also need an astral crystal. Okay. Perfect. <laughs> so, what do you think about this? Mm -hmm. Not bad at all. That's the most you'll get out of me right now. Bring me more materials and I'll whip yes. up something grander. This is plenty enough grand as it is. I never knew Zugal parts were so versatile. Good, good. Thanks. Glad to hear it. I'll leave the rest in your hands. Go give the Ren a hell. Set us free, okay? That's the plan. Is this something you're into? Yeah. These ingenious structures and gadgets never cease to amaze me. Check out these handle grooves. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be seeing here. Uh, let's check our skill panel. Ooh, we got a lot. Whoa, okay. Um, easier evading. That's what I wanted. Easier evading. And... Hidden Arthur and unleashes a barrier, a barrage of thrust before concluding with a dramatic slash. Ooh. Bad. Ooh, and you've got a lot. Ooh, what are you things? Meals me, meals cooked eight. Aerial enemies down by boost attack 20. Okay. Increase ailment bonus damage, increase near death attack, increase ailment rates. Uh, what are her arts? Gemini, Aqua, Toxicity, Magna Ray, Sir Resurrection. Okay, yeah, so it's in there, all right. Cool. Do we have full stuff, or can't quite remember. All right, let's see here. Oh no, we probably should rest. Probably should rest, just to be sure, because I definitely want to... Whoop. Uh, oh yeah, grilled mushrooms. Yeah, let's have me cook. This is great. The taste and aroma will blow everyone away. Yeah! Elemental defense up. Well, that's pretty good. I could literally just keep resting and then get Xion more stuff. Don't work too hard out there. I do also like that the titles still give, uh, the titles, like, give you an, an idea of what you need in order to unlock them first. So, okay. So, go in here and talk to Zephyr. All right, everyone. It's time. Remember, eyes on the prize. We're after Balsef. Nothing else. Cut off the head, and the snake perishes. Hit them head on, however. And we won't make it through the castle gates, let alone reach Balsef himself. Luckily, we have an ace up our sleeve. We need to do everything in our power to make sure that ace reaches Balsef's jugular. To that end, I'll be splitting us up into separate forces. 
You just said all of us hitting them head on would be useless. Why would we divide ourselves up? Because we're the decoys. We'll buy our ace in the hole the time they need to get in. We only need to cause enough of a ruckus around the castle to distract the enemy. That said, we need to look like the real deal. Which is why I'll be tagging along, too. You too, Zephyr? So, who's going to take on Balsef? The Iron Mask. I'm counting on you and Xion to make your way to wherever Balsef's hiding. Once there, you drive that flaming sword right through him. You aren't seriously sending in just those two, are you? One of them's a Renin. No one said the plan was perfect. By far, the biggest danger is the one you two will be facing. The fate of this quest rests entirely in your hands, which is why you get the final say. You want out? Now's the time to say so. And if we say no? Then you say no. Just means we're back to square one, that's all. And I go back to being a slave. It's your life. No, it isn't. Ball's in your court, soldier. What do you say? I... I want to fight. But for what? What are you fighting for? To free the Danans from the yoke of their abusive oppressors. To no longer die at the whim of another. To break the shackles of our enslavers. To live and taste freedom! Now you're talking. I believe we have our ace in the hole, people. Hold on to that belief, and we just might break through that wall yet. And what about you? I was born ready. Now can we get this show on the road? <laughs> There's a gate on your right once you leave here. Go through it and ride the elevator you'll find. I'll send ahead a few friendly faces to keep watch on your way. If you get into any trouble, look to them for support. We all clear? Good. May this battle herald the end of the Renan's bloody three-century reign. To your battle stations, everyone. Yeah, we're gonna take him down. Take this guy down. Take the geared garrison elevator to the castle. Ooh. What? I heard that. I heard that hoo hoo. Owl friend? Where are thou, owl friend? There you are. Hello. Are those dog ears? Bunny ears? Rabbit ears. I'm surprised there are owls here, too. Yeah, there are more of them around than I thought. I like that they at least, like, make themselves known. You think I can give... I was like, what if I just don't equip the Iron Mask? Now, how does that happen? How does that happen? I don't know. Okay, are we all, we're all done up here? We need to go right there, yep. Here at Garrison. All right, so we are going to make our way down over to Balsa's Balsa's Castle. Castle. Should be just above us. All right, and let's use that elevator thing. That elevator thing. The elevator will take you to Glenmead Castle. Trench of Flames. Let's go! We're gonna make sure this happens. I am excited to beat this dude's ass. 
infiltrate the castle from the back entrance. One small step for Dana. <sighs> I still can't believe this is happening. We're really about to face off against a Renan Lord. Well, you're in pretty high spirits for a guy going into a life and death battle. I'm not saying I'm not worried. But you have to remember, this is the first time any of us Danans have really had any hope. What about you? Are you scared at all? I don't have time to be scared. This is only the first step in a long, long plan of mine. You want to take down all five lords, right? It's hard to believe it'll ever happen. But it will. I know. I haven't forgotten our deal. See that you don't. That said, if we lose, we might suffer a fate worse than death, you know. That's probably true. But instead of worrying about it, wouldn't it be a better use of our time to figure out ways to avoid that and not lose? I suppose. Whatever happens, I'll put everything I have into winning. You can count on that. Yeah. That's what's gonna happen. We're gonna win. Next time. On the next episode. <laughs> so, thank you all so much for watching. I appreciate your support. Our bunny boy here definitely appreciates it. And uh, if you do enjoy the uh, fantastic tales of Arise, please make sure to like the video and also subscribe to the channel as well. I do make daily content for you guys as well, so uh, hopefully you guys uh, check in every day for new videos, well, whether that be this playthrough or a different one that we're doing. I love to entertain and I'm happy to uh, be doing this with you guys here as well. So. Make sure to drink your water, eat your vegetables, and don't be a dick. And I'll catch you guys all in the next episode. All right. Nerd out. <laughs>